Honor, supposedly there is a third map on PC, and I think it sets in Korea. I'm not really quite sure, but this ma but the map is small as fuck. Tiny map in Korea. <laughs> I this? think I think so. Did I just get feedback in my mic? <laughs> it's so, it's so small though. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm imagining things. Maybe it's Maybelline. Yeah, <laughs> I forgot about this. Uh, fuck, I need a fork. Fork? Are you eating something? Yeah, I was gonna eat some Vienna sausage. Oh, fuck yes. You're not the only... I'm not the, I guess I'm not the only person in the family that eats those. Dude, except our entire family loves Vienna sausage. At least my side of the family <laughs> does. Not everybody. Ernie doesn't eat them. Mabel doesn't eat them. My dad doesn't really eat them. He used to. Your dad's a bitch. Not anymore. I guess I'll just stab him with a spoon. Oh, let's go see where we can go. I guess we're going there. Yo, I fell on my young senpai. Bitch, nigga. Damn, wherever the fuck this place is, we can get to it. Oh, I found it. Hopefully nobody lands here. Yep, yeah, there is one fucker that's landing. Yep, two fuckers. Come on, Hunter, we gotta get our PUBG skills back. <laughs> uh, I don't think they're gone. PUBG's pretty easy to fucking do. PUBG's, PUBG's of... skill base, it's not a random number generator. Uh, I went to eat a yeah. sausage and landed in a tree. Yep, two of these fuckers have... Got their way in. So these guys better not freaking kill me. I'll be one pissed off. Got an AK. Fucker. Nice. Now you can come over here and help me. Are you fighting somebody? Yeah, I'm fighting someone. He did. Nice. I got my skills back. Oh god, please come over here. Jesus. Wait. No! Get away! No, <laughs> Eric lives. Me. What the fuck? Ah! <laughs> Just run to me. Why is life so unfair? <laughs> Just run to me. Oh god, they're in the fucking house! Run to me, dumb fuck. Whoa! Oh god! What the heck? Where are they at? He's he's in this house in front of me. Where are they at? Why? This pistol sucks dick. Oh fuck, watch out Hunter, somebody's over here. Oh god, there were multiple- I killed two of them though. Why was there so many fucking guys at this one damn house on the map? Where there's multiple locations to go for houses, why? 
Oh my lord, this fucking, it's like everywhere we go, there's always gonna be six other fucking people. Vienna sausages actually do get a little bit old after a while. Oh, you can't like eat multiple those, sausages. Those... But like just one oh, no. sparingly. But when Ryan's here, when Ryan's here, me and him like chow down on those fuckers. Me and him just sit in the living room because you usually I don't. Doesn't Ernie and Maple love the fuck of these things? If he's here. No. 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 None, none of them really eat anything. Grandma usually buys them because they're usually for me and Ryan. But I mean, we eat the fuck out of them still. Like Ryan will eat them to death. It's funny because usually Ryan's not a big eater. But he'll fucking eat the fuck out of Vienna sausages. Like if like if it was the end of the world, like if the end of the world was coming, he'd probably buy like fifty fucking boxes of the uh, that shit. <laughs> Who would Ryan? Yeah. Yeah, he probably would. And just keep him in like a safe basement or military uh, attic. We're not adding military, uh, shelter. Damn, I just want the fucking map to be here. <laughs> I mean, they already developed it and shit, why can't they just put it on here anyways? I'm back again. Alright, guess we'll go there. Fucking you with the sack again. Nice. I need to open up my stream, I haven't done that. Alright, where the fuck? I don't see anybody coming over here. <laughs> what, what, fucking, what was that guy that fucking named the actual... Did he also name the actual PUBG maps? Locations? The oh, one guy? uh... Because I know you said he named the Spanish ones, but I don't know if he named the look ones up, that weren't Spanish. Look up, if you're wanting to look up the name, look up uh, PUBG say names. And it'll show... Like, trust me, it'll show. It's fucking funny. Chimichanga. Why is there nothing? There's like non stop you pistols. Got a pistol to shoot you in the pain. <laughs> You're just gonna keep on saying that from now on, are you? Uh, maybe. Let me suppress her for my SMG. Soldiers in this house. I want talkies. Talkies? Oh fuck! I had a yeah. bag of those a week ago. Dude, the New Mexico talkies are so fucking good. Because one time when we were when we were leaving uh, from the wedding that we went to for one of the Trujillos, we went to this gas station in Albuquerque. You really gotta meet these fucks and get drunk with like, them once. Oh, he'll fucking love him to death, Hunter. Like, you'll fucking Trujillos, love him. The they're, like, Eric's cousins, so they're, like, distant to me, I think.
I don't think they would be so much distance to you. I mean, I think one of them is yeah, related to Martinez. Yeah, they would be extended so family. Well. Meaning they might not have complete. Yeah. Uh, they might not have any blood relation, but they're family of family, so they're extended family. Yeah. I think the last time the Martinez's and the and the uh, Trujillo's were truly together was for my mom and dad's wedding. And it's a very last. Either that or one of our family reunions. Yeah, I smoked weed with one of them before at the wedding. We were in the parking lot just fucking smoking it up. We were in the car and just hotboxing the fucking uh, vehicle and I was like, dude, I gotta fucking step out. I have a fucking, like, stroke. And I was like, ah, oh, go ahead. So, some of Maple's family is actually really fun too. It's, it's funny because mo some of most of her family is actually Spanish. Did you know that? I didn't even know that. Fuck yeah, Mabel's she has brown people, as fuck. She has people in her. Oops, mm, sort of. It's obvious she's Spanish. She does not have the complexion of a white woman. <laughs> she's white on the outside, but brown on the inside. Her black, <laughs> Mexicanly greasy hair and her fucking tanned, elderly skin. The fuck. Uh, here's here's information for you. When you get older, as Ernie and Maple are, if you're not Mexican or Spanish, your hair doesn't, or your fucking skin doesn't fucking stay of any shade. It goes straight white. So if it's still kind of shaded oh, no. or brown, they're fucking Spanish as fuck. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know, but still. It's funny because my dad doesn't, looks nothing like that. Julian sort of does, not my dad. Vehicle. My dad just turned into a lumberjack. <clears throat> I hear a vehicle. Yeah, Hunter, I think he's coming right this way. Oh, never mind. Yeah, no, he's not. I just saw him. Yeah, cause there's this guy named Alex on my on my grandma's side that's really fucking fun, and he smokes like a lot of pot and shit. I feel like and we're at their house weed can't in Las Vegas, be New Mexico. A drug. Like, I, I know it's classified as one, but like, I have so many friends that do it, and there's like no negative consequences besides them acting like a total jackass, which is no different to someone <laughs> being drunk. So like, in all honesty, yeah. I don't really give a fuck. You know what I mean? You used to give a fuck about it, about the weed well, smoking yeah, but when I was a little kid, I was fucking up tight, and I thought that good meant good and bad meant bad. Now I just don't give a shit. People could die in front of me, and I still wouldn't feel anything. Like, if I knew them, I would, but if, like, it's a fucking stranger, I'm like, meh, another person dead. My mom <laughs> kind of fucked my head up, so I'm not as empathetic and shit like that as I was when I was a kid. Yeah. She's trying to make up for it now, and we're trying to get closer, but it's kind of like a tug and pull situation. Yeah. Bryce doesn't help it, because he likes to start fights about my dad, and then I'll fucking say shit that pisses him off, because I'll, I'll bring shit up about him, and he's like, what the fuck, man? And I'm just like, here, come get this M16. I already, I already have one. Shit. Yeah, I miss the good times like this back when we used to get fucking chicken dinners and all that shit. Yeah, yeah Hunter, like I said, yeah, I need to introduce you to a few people. There's gonna be, I think some of the Trujillos are coming down, so I want to introduce you to them if if you show up. Do what? I said I, I said I do need to I do want you to I do want to introduce you to some some of the Trujillos though because some of them are coming down for Shayla's graduation and if you do show up I want to introduce you to them. See I'm going to really show up for Shayla's graduation and then not show up for Brayden's wedding. I know that sounds slightly fucked up but it's just dude I love Brayden to death and he might be one of my most favorite cousins mostly because he's one of the very few that didn't 
amount to nothing and turn into a complete and total piece of shit. Uh, you are in that category, not the piece of shit category. You're in the, you, you're going to make something of yourself, I think. And then I think I got Gavin in there too. And Kayla yeah. and currently Cody on my mom's side, but the rest of them, they're in that gray area. Who's your four favorite? Do what? Who's your four favorite of them all? Like people that you would just like fuck my with top like four any cousins. day. Like just chill it. Like just, yeah, just like chill and fucking Tr uh, sit down, have, a, have a few drinks on, or two. Uh, actually, I forgot about Trenton. I still count him as a kid, so I don't put him in any categories. Trenton's really cool. He's uh, my uncle on my mom's side's son, and he's he's a pretty cool kid. Although I'm kind of worried he might start turning out like Bryce because he kind of thinks Bryce is cool. And you know Bryce? Bryce will fucking drag you down the drain and let you drown. Yeah. Like, like don't get me wrong. Bryce is cool on his own, but when he tries to influence other people, it's like it's like drugs. <laughs> it's stupid. The thing I don't trust is him smoking weed. I think he acts more crazy of him smoking pot than getting drunk. Yeah, Bryce, Bryce is just fucking different. But, uh... See, I feel like Trenton's easily corruptible, like a lot of my cousins on my mom's side. So, like, if they meet someone that they think's cool, they're gonna do everything they fucking think in their power to fucking please them. And I'm afraid Trenton might be like that. So I hope to... I'm glad that he's never around Bryce. So the only thing he gets is through, like, Snapchats and stuff. Oh, yeah, true. And those don't influence him as much, but they still slightly do. But, uh... Fucking... Trenton, you, uh... Brayden... I really don't hang out with a lot. Gavin's pretty cool now, too. He used to not be, but Gavin's matured. But that's kind of sad when two of them are still technically little kids. I know. That's what sucks about it. To be fair, Damn, a lot of <laughs> my cousins on my mom's side, they're not bad people. It's just, like, the cousins on the Martinez side, Braden would stop anything to fucking help me, even though we're not as close as like me and a lot of my other cousins because Braden's good family. Braden isn't even technically blood related to us, but I count Braden on a tier above any other fucking relative I have. You know what I mean? There was one time the only th the only time I ever got mad at Braden was when after he went to Kuwait and stayed there for like a shitload of months and when he finally came back and when we ended up seeing him at Zippies, he didn't say a fucking word to me. He didn't say yeah, he didn't say a single word to me. He didn't look at me, and he just talked to my dad the whole time. And, and he didn't say bye See, to me when we left. I, and I was just, there's one and I was thing like, I, there's one thing I do have a problem with. Fucker. Raiden, Raiden can get arrogant. It's not like directly being yeah. a dick, but like he, the way he doesn't think about the way he acts, like pissing other people off. Like he makes himself look high and mighty, and I don't think he realizes it because like my cousin Cody on my mom's I, side. I was pissed. There was one time, was Brayden pissed. was a lifeguard, and Cody was dicking around at the pool, and like, yeah, Brayden has a job to do, but also, like, Cody probably wasn't doing anything as bad as, like, anyone else at the pool. It's just, I think Brayden just didn't like my mom's side of the family, because, you know, the Martinez's and my mom's side, they still talk shit on each other to this day. Uh, they try not, Grandpa and Grandma try not to, but Grandpa gets very passionate when talking about my mother about how much he is mad about shit she did in the past but yeah. grandma says that she still loves mom even though all that shit she did because she's still our mother you know we wouldn't exist without her true uh and it's just one of those things i don't know why the fuck we're getting out because uh there's i think there's a few buildings over here that hasn't been uh wooden but always like this, you can't. You end up finding sour apples and other like, shit. Like, I don't know. Me and Brayden have never been really close. Also, it's probably because he does not fucking talk to me. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Me and Mason fucking probably argued most out of me and a lot of my cousins, but we could hold the fucking conversation. I just can't hold the conversation with Brayden because, like, he's a cool guy and stuff, but he's boring. If that makes sense. I can. I just He's, cannot stand fucking talking to Mason because we would always argue as kids, and he would think that he was right about everything. I was fucking, like, you know what? Have it your way, fucker. Yeah, yeah. Bray Brayden's just kind of like we don't like the same thing. So to me, he's boring. Mason was a fucking crybaby. I remember oh, when Mason once was a he got hit with the water balloon. 
He used to uh, talk so much shit, and then we would beat the shit out out of him as a kid, and then he would fucking cry and tell his parents. But, like, when we were little, remember how I was, like, super tiny and I was pacifist? Fucking Mason tried to bully me and shit, and then one time I went to fucking Tina's, and fucking Mason, like, bashed my fucking head into the fireplace for no fucking reason. And then Tina and Uncle Sean are like, you probably deserved it. (sighs) And that's probably one of the reasons I don't get along with that side of the family it's just the shit they did when we were kids was like i know he's your kid but what the <laughs> fuck man yeah i didn't agree with the way hey don't drive off without me fuck uh, i didn't agree with the way that they raised him because i mean look at mason now he's like a fucking party animal and he needs to kind of get reined in a little bit well, mason like, mason's kind of living the life now i mean he's a college boy him. he's getting old he's got no, he fucking... dropped out of college Dropped out of college? Yeah, he fucking partied it up too much and fucking... Uh, his, I got told he partied it up too much and then fucking just bailed out. When I went and saw him and Sean, they told me that Mason, like Sean, decided college life wasn't for him. But sadly, he went to college with Drew Winners. And I know the shit that those guys did. Yeah. So there's no way in fuck Drew, they didn't party their fucking brains out and fail some fucking tests. Drew was a stoner in high school. Drew's a little bastard, because I'm also cousins with Drew, too. Drew is for real? Drew Renners and me are step cousins through fucking the Minden Halls. The fuck? Yeah, the winners are fucking Galen Dar- and Darlene, the grandparents of the Minden Halls. Keep driving this oh, car shit. parked here. Uh, they're fucking related to them. Yeah. And uh, as a little kid, like, I wasn't a very big little kid, and Drew would fucking try to bully me and shit. Like, Drew and fucking Mason for some reason decided, hey, we're gonna bully our fucking flesh and blood, even though I'm technically not flesh and blood of Drew, but we're related, so try not to be a dick. Yeah. It's, it's Mason and Bryce are very similar in the department, where, like, they take family for granted. Because every time I see Bryce and Mason at Grandma and Grandpa's, it's like they only come around whenever they want something, or they're forced to come by. Yeah, that's true. Because Mason, to me, still hasn't grown the fuck up. He's not, he'll, he probably never will. He's and don't get me dad. wrong, don't get me wrong, uh, I'm pretty sure that this is fucking loudly spoken about on Sean's side. You know me, I'm very opinionated, and I will fucking speak my mind. Oh, definitely. Yeah, well, I make myself I know, look like I know an how ass, you work. <laughs> because I, I, I make myself look like an ass sometimes, because sometimes I just can't control it, and I, when I get fucking pissed or opinionated, I will fucking tell you how the fuck I feel. That is my main quality. Yeah. And fucking... We were at a family reunion, and this one, this one, I'm probably going to hell for. And fucking, I, I'm pissed at my mom, cause you know my mom, fucking, when we were, when we were kids, she fucked up, and then like, she like yeah. fucked up and taking care of me and all that stuff, and she would always bring people into her house and take care of them better than she took care of her kids. And I even told her this one time, uh, I like, she knows why I got mad at her. Well, she, I love Harold's family to death. Harold is a family friend, and his daughter sadly got knocked up in high school and the dude who knocked her up didn't want to take care of the kid well we're at a family reunion and my mom fucking took her his daughter in and had her live with them my mom also took the brother in and had them live with them at a certain point like they were already living with them at a certain point but then the dad got a house and they all moved out which i was mad about to begin with and then she got knocked up and mom took care of her whenever she was in trouble and i'm like my mom hasn't always been there for me whenever uh, shit's gone bad not until now where like my mom is a like a walking shadow of her former self it's sad i don't know what the fuck happened to her but like she doesn't have like emotions that well anymore and like i think she realized that she fucked up way back when and she's like coming to terms with i was kind of a dick but like there's not a lot you can do (laughs) about it so my mom i think my mom's probably clinically depressed in all honesty i think that's why she wanted so many goddamn kids oh fuck fuck you fuck, you duped us all. Got his ass. Watch out, there's another dude here somewhere. Yeah, I think he's in the adjacent buildings. Uh, he's fuck. trying to light me up, he's, he's behind me. Out. He's behind me. Yeah, he's over to the side of me. He's he's over here. I see him. 165. I gotta fucking use him first. Don't want to flashbang out. He's behind that fucking... Eric, no! No! Fuck! 
Got him. Good job, honey. Good job. No problem. Uh, God, this fucking lightsaber kid keeps sending me invites. It's I just that it. I don't. It's just that I don't have any. Uh, I don't have any scopes for my uh, rifle. That's the fucking sad part. I did you not pick up that M16 I dropped for you and told you to pick up in the house? It had four times on it. I have an M16. Oh, there is. Oh, fuck. Should have been a four times. I'm taking guys. his level two helmet. Okay. He's back. I wonder what that other dude had. Oh my god, this guy has so much fucking ammo. It was was it in this house, Hunter? Uh no no no, it was way back when, dude. Like you've already fucked oh, up. Oh shit. Like there ain't no going back for that bitch. But anyway, um uh, okay. no, like I don't know, like I know your family is a shit show because you guys got divorced. Oh, dude, it was fucking bad. Yeah, my and like, here's the thing, here's the thing. I kind of wish my parents wouldn't have had me. I won't that's say not, that. That's not, that's not, no, 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 hear me out, hear me out. I know it sounds bad, but listen to this. That's not that I don't appreciate the life I'm given or the friends I have or the family I have or anything like that. It's just the fact that my parents had me at an early age where they hadn't figured out if they yeah. truly loved each other or not to get married. They got rushed into things. They got overly panicked. They both became bad guys in a sense. Exactly. That, and, was, that was my mom and dad. Yeah, they yeah. Got and married, they both uh, became bad guys after in a they sense. Knew each other. They both, they both like, did really fucked up things. Because when you're a kid, you panic. I mean, I've had a pregnancy scare too. I'm not even going to fucking deny it. And I know a lot of people out there have. But like... When you're like pushed into that shit at a young age, you just you just react, and then shit sticks. Well, yeah. like you're not gonna make the right choices the first time. Of course you're not, uh, and that's kind of what happened. But then like they made so many bad choices to begin with that they couldn't correct themselves with good choices. And then like further down the line, my mother got with her kids. The better she was to them, but like the damage had already been right. dealt. And like personally, I could forgive a whole lot of the shit she did. Some of it's unforgivable, but some of it's not. Like, I got super right. jealous whenever she remarried and had kids with that guy, and she treated and with and she treated them a lot better. And I probably shouldn't have seen it that way. Hunter, not to interrupt. Uh, there's some AK ammo for you in here if you need any. I don't have AK. Oh, you don't have an AK? No, okay, I have a scar. Did. I have a scar with a scope. Okay. All right. But but basically, just by the way, I made my way up the hill. You're still in the town. Uh, yeah, I see. But, Coming your way. You know, like, I feel like, you know, I don't, I don't technically agree with abortion. Uh, in some cases, I think it should be a thing, like if a girl was raped. But other than that, I don't really. Yeah. I'm not that asshole who's like, oh, this chick got raped. She, oh, she's still gotta have that kid, or she's a monster. Fuck no. You know, Brasado was raped. Uh, pro, you're, you're on stream, bud. Oh, yeah, she was right by her uncle. <laughs> Damn, oh, I see there, There's like two of them over there. Hey, let's, cr let's crouch down and make, the, make our way through them, uh, to them. I'm just pushing up to this tree. Okay. Watch out. Holy crap! <laughs> I got him! Oh my god! Don't go near him, don't go near him! I threw two. <laughs> Watch out, there's another guy alive, I think. Yeah, there's guys left at the fucking brick houses next to him. Never mind, never mind. You Fuck better fucking love me, cousin. I fucking love you to death. You had a level Where 3 vest, oh, and it's in perfect condition, I'm taking it, I deserve that. Yeah, you deserve it. But I need a scope. I, like, I need a fucking scope. But no, like... I just feel like people should... If you're having Eight sex, times, and, here I, we go. and I know lust can get the better of people, but if you're having sex, you need to keep what the fuck could happen if you fucked up or knocked him up. And I know, like, yeah, yeah lust will get the better of people and shit like that, but, like, god damn, man. You really gotta think, because it can have long-lasting effects that fuck over. Like, I'm not technically right in the fucking head. I'm still a decent person and stuff, but, like, I've kind of lost my composure with, like, sympathy and stuff because of all the bad shit that happened to me as a kid. That's not good. All right. Let's move up this way. Moving hang on, the hang edge on. of the circle. Let me guess. I'm trying to get some shit. But like, 
I don't know. I just... I just don't know. Like, what are your opinions on, like, fucking that shit? What do you think, personally? Well, to me, I mean, the same goes, like, with what you said about the whole raping scenario, because the freaking... Because I know half the population inside of the United There's States this way. has been rape victims. Coming into the fucking zone, okay. let's fucking stick in and just fucking wait them out. They're uh, 20 north okay. and northeast. They're like coming in, but let's just wait them out and say fuck them. But continue your statement. Uh, but yeah, like I said, um, there is some situations where I think abortion should be legal because there has been people that have been raped and have had to deal with baby problems like from oh, yeah, like, like years and years and years. Young, hey, here they are. Oh, I see him. They're gonna get fucked. Knocked one. Knocked Shit. the other. Got I'm, him killed. Need ammo. Let's get in the zone. Get in the zone. I killed them both. Alright. All right. Welcome, cousin. Uh, God, I got, I'm so good at this game. I forgot how good I was. <laughs> Uh, I miss this shit. I kind of did too. I just wish our friends would get back into it. But uh, they won't really get into it now know, since it's the fucking oh since season yeah. four from Brendan's Fortnite. in the fucking chat. He is. <laughs> yeah, he's in the chat talking. But no, like I don't know. Like that top, those topics are like things that should never uh, have ever Hunter, been. Come over here for a minute. Season. Come over here for a minute. Okay, coming. Let's 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 fucking scout this area, cause I don't for some weird reason I don't trust this hillside. Okay. Right. I was gonna move in to the zone. I don't know why I just don't trust this fucking hillside. Like I'm afraid that there's some dude in, in like the bushes somewhere. Eric, come on, we gotta get in the zone, bro. I don't know. And you're kind of at a I just don't want to fucking get caught. Because I know there's people 245 in those woods. Yeah, I know. I got there's an A-time, so holding those if, houses. Anything gets, if anything still gets bad. Yeah. Dude, I fucked those guys at that fucking car. That grenade throw was flawless. Oh, fuck. I, know. I, I got oh. shot in the ass. You did? Okay. Oh, fuck. I'm getting shot from... Uh, west. Maybe okay, not. come over here with me. Wait, west? No, not west, because I'm heading west. west. I'm heading Maybe west. Maybe east. They're shooting me from the fucking houses, that's what it is. I am. Oh don't shit. I don't know how I'm still Get alive. The fucking... What I am. I hear people from every direction. Hunter, fucking you gotta healing. fucking move, man. I'm healing, I'm healing. I'll make my way to you shortly. These fucking people in the house have me pinned. Damn, Hunter. Oh, fuck! Oh, God. If I get shot, I'm fucked. This zone is raping me. I can't fuck... Why? Ugh... Where did you- is he somewhere on you south, still? Somewhere between south and southwest, or some fucking guy. God damn it. Fuck! Why does the storm have to fucking- like... Why does it have to fucking end in the middle of a goddamn green field? You know you're- Out of anywhere, it had to have been a fucking, fucking green field. Fortnite when you're like, fuck, I need shields. Yeah. And when you need, and when you need to build. There's only ten others left to fucking live. Okay, I see this fuck. This is. Motherfucker, make him pay. Knocked him. Good job. Oh shit! Got them both. Nice. Nice. Oh. Nice. Fucking American sniper. <laughs> I'm fucking American snipering it up, bro. That's why we gotta have nicknames. Oh shit! Uh, in front of you, in front of you, uh, on your right. There's there's a guy hiding in the, hiding it uh, on your right. Look more out there. There was Where a at? guy. 
Yeah, like right where you where you were like this looking way? out there. Yes. Yeah, there was a fucking guy out there somewhere. I don't see him. He was like right out there. I'm just letting these fucks fight it out. Fuck. Oh, you're, you're gonna have to move though, Hunter. I like the storm. This uh, this storm's coming in two seconds. I know, but I'm the closest one to it. I think. Fuck you! Now you gotta go. <laughs> Or are you trying to make your way through the... Try not to get shot guys. inside by the fucking guys at the house. I don't even know if they're still there. Watch out, in front of you! Ah, oh, someone else got me. Shit. Fuck, I was doing pretty good though. That fucking was pretty good storm, game. man. Seven fucking kills, yeah, it was. bro. But, uh, I only got four. How are you and Brisada doing? Uh, well, we're we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Uh, are you guys gonna go she's, to the same college? She's just. Yeah, Brandon, Hunter, I probably I know you're go to college. You probably won't go to college. Yeah, you but I did get a NASVAP grade. score like tremendously for the military. I'm eligible enough for any military uh, branch, uh, so I can go to the Air Force if I want. Yeah, fair enough. But I was actually really looking forward to going to the army. Because I actually like the army more than the fucking Air Force. <laughs> Your fucking legs look like Vienna sausages. <clears throat> you know who I really want you to meet, Hunter? Do what? There's a fan. You know who I really want you to meet? Who? There's a, uh, uh... Brendan, I acknowledged you like tw 10 minutes ago, bro. <laughs> I've seen your chat. I've stated that you've been in here for, like four times. I know you're there. Anyway, continue your statement, Eric. Uh, there's a family on my grandma's side that I really want you to meet, and their their names are the, are the Quigleys. <laughs> it's kind of a funny last name. I think you've told me about <clears throat> Yeah, but they're really fun, and the first night I met them, I got drunk with them. <laughs> And we got along ever since. Huh. Because we were there, because it was, yeah. Especially the mom. The mom is a fucking. I was talking to says a girl from our there, student that government she's an alcoholic. school earlier today. Uh -huh. And like, I'm going to Hayes. She's like, I'm going to Hayes too. I'm like, hey, you want to be drinking buddies? And she's like, fuck yeah, sure. And we shared each other's Snapchats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's cool you're going to Hayes, Hunter. With me, I'm probably not going to go to any college. I kind of wish you would go to college, though, but. I have been thinking about it, but I probably just won't go, Hunter. I've, the military has been on my mind, on my mind ever since I was in diapers. <laughs> That's what the military does to you when uh when uh, your dad's in the, been in the academy for the longest ass time. Okay, makes you wanna Wait, set, fucking drop. join. Wait, oh fuck! I yeah, have like I said, on. Uh, I'm just in undies. Well, like I said, Hunter. Uh, yeah, in 2015. I'm, Either 2015 or 2016, we were there for a uh, graduation for the, a girl named Reese, which is in their family. Yeah. Reese Quigley, and we were there. We were, we were at a. They, they graduated at a Catholic church, and yeah. I was like, really? What the fuck? And but we were there for the longest ass time, and then after that, we we left, and we go to the after party, which is at their house, and we got totally fucking wasted. And his, his her uh, her boyfriend is like a Vietnam. Is like a Vietnam guy, but he, but he, he, uh, he goes to college and all that, but he's like this really buff Vietnam dude, and he doesn't he speak any Vietnamese. His parents are Vietnamese, and and I guess he came to America, or I, I don't think he was born in Vietnam. I think he was just, he was born in America, but his, both of his parents were from Vietnam, and uh, his name's like Hung, his name's Hung Dao, <laughs> but he speaks like the perfect English, like he speaks like us, and uh. He, um, like, we got along, like, so fucking well, and there was this one, there's only one white girl that I like, that I had the most, biggest fucking crush on, and her name was Haley Mace, or Haley Macy, I think, and she was, like, fucking, like, pretty as fuck, and you know, I, 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 I'm pretty sure I wanted to date her for the, for the longest time.
Uh, you know, I'm brown complected, but I'm like white soul. I was raised white. Yeah. And, uh, so was I. I don't. I find every race attractive. I don't have that deal where, like, some white guys are like, ooh, black chicks. I don't have that, but. Yeah, Sammy, yeah, I know this you're Haley one of those. Yeah, because this Haley girl was at the party? You're one of those guys, Cause but, this, uh. Because this Haley girl was at the party at, at their house, and we had so much fun. It was dark outside, and we had the bonfire. In, the, in their backyard, and we were just drinking it up, and we were we were playing the game Never Have I Ever, yep. and every time we we did something, or every time we we lost us something, we had to drink like a cup, and we just got fucking wasted. AJ says that I'm now his favorite cousin because I I guess I got I was really go to a different building, bud. <laughs> yeah, I heard you. I don't know where else to go to. <laughs> I don't There's really want to go to those other ones because I know they don't really don't hold up a bunch of assault anyway. rifles. Uh, but no, uh, like. I I normally get along more with white chicks, mostly because, like, common backgrounds, even though I don't look like it at first, so it takes a while for me to warm up to them. You know what I mean? I, I, f I, I found her on Facebook and everything. I mean, Ryan Martinez actually talks to, to Reese and, and all them still. We were supposed to see him when we were at the Willie Nelson's concert. Is that concert the black deal, adopted kid but... in our family? Who? Is that who the black adopted kid in our family is, Therese? Yeah, Therese. Uh, we're, I'm supposed to go to Isn't a graduation kind of party a for him here, uh, in, in Fridge. He used to be, but he's, oh, he got I think his he act got blessed together? in a lot of ways. Yeah, I think he has. Thank back God, then, that, back when he, he wasn't in the family, my dad like hated him. He acted like a fucking him. stereotype, and then every time he was around you fucking guys, he pissed me off, because he fucking wouldn't shut the fuck up about doing dumb shit. I'm like, dude, they're fucking kids, bro. Yeah, that's true. It's like Bryce whenever he fucking showed up to uh, fucking Uncle Sean's house and they were like little eight-year-old uh, kids that were like our second or third cousins with the fucking uh, – uh, well, technically they're extended family because they're Mason's cousins and it was through the other hunter. Yeah. Uh, his little sisters and his little brother and all that, they were all at the house and uh, Bryce comes in and he's like, guys, guess how cool cutting yourself is and shows them all his fucking cut marks. What the fuck? That's how you know he's he the cut biggest the wrong piece of parts shit. on the arm. Uh, kind of acted like it. Uh, I said he acted like it. I don't know. Hunter, do you smoke weed? No. There's a level two vest. Ever have? Second floor attic. Uh, not really. I've smoked I think it one by time. Like my buddy tried to get me life. contact high, but. He couldn't. <laughs> Not to mention, I've got like fucked up lungs since birth. You know the the, the like weird lungs I was born with as a kid. Uh, they've adjusted, but you can like, ask I don't. My dad. <laughs> I, I don't take it air my... intake very well, so I can't even hardly take hits off of a vape. So I couldn't imagine trying to hit, take hits uh, off of anything else. Well, to be honest, <sighs> to be honest, Hunter. You know, actually, it's weed isn't like cigarettes to where like when you blow it in, you're, it's gonna make you cough right away. Like in you order for you to Scar, cough, you have I've to. Been in a relationship for two years. Uh, even <laughs> I have been in a relationship for two years. Uh, okay, bye. Uh, I mean, like, Jesus, Brendan, your shit is I mean, so like, random. Uh, but yeah, Hunter, like it's like it's not like when you take a hit, you automatically cough. Like it, in order for you to cough while you're smoking weed, you have to hold it in. So you can actually take the longest hit, like, you want, but Just, you are going to cough if you hold it in, no matter how much time you hold in the smoke, the smoke and heat. I don't have any reason to do weed, though, so I don't really want to. Uh, like, they made it to me, worldwide, I kind of had a reason to because it. I was kind of bummed out by a bunch of stuff, and I, I wasn't really getting all my family at the time. In all honesty, I, I know a lot of the friends I, that smoke weed that I know of, they don't smoke it because they think it's cool. They smoke it because they have depressing fucking lives with terrible fucking family. And they're like, well, I ain't got shit but to do but watch TV and smoke weed. And that's understandable. I registered to, I registered to vote today for the presidential crap. But Fuck, now, my, I don't, now my dad wants me to vote for the medical marijuana bill that's going to... That Hoping, hopefully they're going to pass here in Oklahoma sometime in June. Your dad uh, is the scoviest of scum. I love your dad to death, but like, it pisses me off because... Like, shit, I'm surprised how, he even said that. Uh, he's still family... And he's one of the few family that doesn't think he's fucking better than me. 
Your dad knows yeah, at least I don't one know thing. About that. Your dad knows humility. He won't admit it. He knows humility, but tell. he thinks he he thinks he knows everything though. And he's that's what caused my funny, my mom and like, dad to get divorce. But, but like, because my dad was always right in the relationship. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of like one of them deals. And like your dad, your dad pisses me off the way he treats you and stuff and all that. And then like my dad and him are like super close. And my dad's like, yeah. That's why I don't live with him anymore. Yeah. And I, I just to be honest anymore. So I just your decided, dad and my you know, dad are it, very similar. Uh, but never fucking admit it. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, they say the people you hang around influence you. Well, our parents used to hang out around each other all the time as kids. Uh, right. And I feel like your dad might have been the dude to kind of get my dad into some dumb shit, but it also could have been vice versa. <laughs> Probably. Uh, but, you know, like... From from Brett, <laughs> so because I mean sometimes Hunter, you have to admit, uh, Brett wasn't always the angel. Brett was not a good kid. I mean, he used to get my dad into some shit. Yeah. Oh no, I, I'm aware. My dad mostly got into like fights and pussy shit, like fucking actual fucking pussy, yeah. and he was doing dumb shit to get the pussy. But uh, no fucking. What is it? I, th that's one thing that makes me mad, though. My dad was fucking crazier than I was, did a bunch of dumb shit, but, like, I do one thing that's not even remotely close to the dumb shit he used to, and immediately I'm retarded. <laughs> I'm like, you know what? It, that, that's one of the few things me and my dad we don't get along with. My dad likes to play the fucking high road shit and try to act like the mature adult, and I'm like, dude, you played fucking video games till you were, like, fucking... 20 something and then stop playing them because you you were like well I have a wife that has sex with me every day I'm good <laughs> but I'm pretty sure your dad probably still plays doesn't he no not anymore uh, that might he's be the really reason about why because I think they kind of but he's getting it. old too he's almost 40 years old <laughs> he, he left and then came back fucking Brendan uh, but no I feel like my dad's just kind of a different person. My dad's very hypocritical, yeah. but he doesn't see it. And I hold my tongue because yeah, I don't true. talk back to him. But, like, I could roast my dad so fucking hard. Hey, let's get this fucker. That's, hey, uh, me... That just won that gray shack. Oh, he just went to a gray shack? Okay, sweet. Uh, yeah. Yep, oh, see he got out. Yeah, he's... He's making his way. I have to take this... Here, let's, let's go around the, the right. back over here. He's in here to the right. I'm already fucking in here. Alright. I think he's upstairs. Hopefully not. This door's open, but the other door isn't. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of scared about. Oh, I see him. He's in the, he's in the other building. Uh, 80 East. I just looked through the window, he was, he just went out there. So he ran to that, or what? Yeah. Yeah, he just opened that fucking door. Uh, I don't know what you mean by, are you right or are you left, Brennan? You're a weirdo. Uh, I'm gonna have to join him. Oh, oh right shit! On the staircase. His fucking teammates coming down. Oh fuck! Yeah, I knew he'd do that. Oh fuck! He had a scar. He fucked me. Damn. Uh, here, give me a sec. I gotta accept fuck. this invite. I'll be right back. Logan invited me to a party. Ah, uh, Logan playing Siege. I see. I was fucking in the middle of a game of PUBG, you cunt. <laughs> I was playing with my cousin. Joe? No one's fucking on or playing any games. Fucking, all I see is like you playing these side fucking bullshit games and fucking, uh, fucking Sean not doing shit. Sean is probably asleep. Slade is at a concert. I've been sick all fucking day again. If you want to play Siege, can my cousin allergy. play with us? 
Yeah, sure, why not? Right. I thought I sent him an invite. I don't think you did. Hmm. Oh, uh, I must have accidentally sent it to Demolisher instead of him. Smooth. Whoops. Well, their names are right next to each other. It's fair. So. I mean, it's, it's a fair. It's a fair thing. Yeah. Well, we're fixing to go over to Siege, so I'm gonna name my stream oh, okay. uh, real fast, but. Uh,